Good morning, everyone. We are here at the airport. We are going to Orlando, Florida today. We are so excited. It is Friday, September 13th. Let's not talk about it. We are so excited to be going to Orlando today. It's very early for us. We woke up at 2.30 in the morning, um, but we have just checked in. We went through TSA and now we're looking at what food we're gonna get. All right, it's just about to be six in the morning. It's still dark outside. This is crazy. I feel like we've been awake for hours because we have. Um, so we got some coffee. Mine is like a big excessive order. The lady even came to me and she was like, wait, is this what you wanted? And I was like, yes. And she goes, it's going to be really sweet. And I'm like, it's okay. This is what I like. So if you like sweet things, this is the venti iced white mocha with pumpkin cream cold foam caramel drizzle and three pumps of pumpkin sauce Ooh. Alex wanted an iced chai latte so I was like let's make it pumpkin-y so we added some pumpkin cream cold foam and caramel drizzle as well this is a little sweet for him he doesn't like sweet things but it's still good by our gate we have there's not much food options so we went to alfred's and we got some bagels we're gonna eat that now we're sh we should be boarding soon in a couple of minutes um and then our flight leaves at 6 50 so we're gonna relax and eat our food We have arrived at Orlando. It is just about to be three and we are here. Yay! Safe and good flight. Yay, we're excited. We are outside now. We just picked up our bags from baggage claim and we are outside waiting for our Uber. We did not rent a car for this trip and this is pretty new to us taking ubers well for me at least alex did for his miami trip that he did we're doing ubers and i'm telling alex that you're going to take charge on this <laughs> um so we are currently waiting outside and of course one thing that i noticed just standing out here it is humid yes like it's not even hot like it just feels sticky like you're walking into a sauna and that's just from standing out here for five minutes but oh well this is what I signed up for. Yeah, we are waiting for our Uber and we're gonna head to our hotel, Sonder Cyrus. See you there. We are in. We just got to our hotel. We're staying at Sonder Cyrus. Hello, home for the next week. It is 4.45, we just checked into our hotel. I'm gonna do a room tour for you guys. Now, this is not a Disney resort. We're not staying on property. We booked this room very early on, like early in the year for 400, it was like a little over $400 for a whole week. So that's like, that's amazing price. Like you're paying that for one room in Disney. But then like I wanted to, the more I thought about it, I was like, I wanna stay on property. So we tried to, you know, cancel the reservation for here, but they were like, oh, we can't issue a refund cause we didn't get like the insurance for it or whatever. So we were like, okay, we'll just stick with it. And next time we'll stay on Disney property. But for now we're here. You guys are like not too crazy and, and don't need to stay on property. This may be a good recommendation for you guys. So this is Sonder Cyrus and we are in Kisse, Kissimmee and we are 10 minutes away from the Disney parks. So we're still close by. This is our room. So it's a pretty big spacious room. So when you walk in, it has a couch. This is a little table right here. And I just put kind of like all of the stuff like that will, we don't want to forget like umbrellas. I got a foot massager because of all the walking we're going to do. Fans, ponchos, and my selfie stick. So like all of the, the stuff that doesn't have like a necessary home i just put it there so we can grab it as we leave this is the table it's a long table um you can do a lot of things here and then they have a stool right there so if you want to sit here's the tv 
and then they have a little coffee station right here this is the mini fridge that they have and then they have a microwave as well the storage um not like anything too bad luckily we have packing cubes so we just put it in there but this is what the drawers look like the bed is nice and big here's a little tip for you guys so like i said we're not staying on property but i still wanted to make it feel like when we come back to our room like the disney vibes are still going so i actually got these stuffed animals bought them purposely so we can have them here for when we return we can still feel like oh like you know the magic continues just like when you are on property you know they have disney themed rooms so we kind of did that ourselves a little DIY project but look how cute Pooh and Dumbo how adorable here is the restroom uh, very nice and spacious that's one thing about this room it's it's pretty spacious um, but here it is I guess this could be a little bit bigger but that's okay um, nice nice place to get ready in the morning to take a shower here is the shower very nice shower um, comes with all of these soaps and yeah looks nice look at that how cute pink and blue so it's about to be six we just finished getting ready this is my outfit it's not too much disney themed um because i'm saving that for the parks but this is a cute little dress that i have and then i did my hair and my makeup really quickly and then i have to represent some disney so here are my ears and it's sprinkling outside it's starting to sprinkle so it says a hundred percent chance of rain in the next hour so we already forgot our umbrella and the uber's on the way so our first mistake but it's okay we can stay inside by the way we're going to disney springs we're gonna eat some dinner because we are hungry we didn't eat much today so we are hungry and we're gonna stuff our face let's see what alex is wearing because alex looks so cute uh, here's my outfit all black button shirt Pants and uh, tie. Look at the tie. Mickey tie. It's so cute. Adorable. We are here at Disney Springs. We are getting some dinner at the House of Blues. We are so hungry, can't wait to eat. We just placed our orders, but I got my drink right here. So this is the Havana Mojito. So pretty, nice and pink rose color. Let's try it. Really good, nice. So we got the jalapeno cornbread. Um, and it's actually really good. It's kind of like, a hint of uh, it's like cornbread, a hint of spice from the jalapeno. They include this butter, which is um, a little sweet, but it pairs well with the heat. So yeah, it's pretty good. But then there's gumbo. I get a mess. <laughs> Oh, that's really good. So we just got our actual meals. I know, we just stuffed our face with appetizers. So we have our actual meal right now. Um, I got the brisket burger. It has crispy onions inside. Oh, I bit my tongue. I've been my tongue. This is a really good pulled pork sandwich. I love pulled pork. The brioche bun is like super good, super soft. The pork itself, like it's different than what I'm usually used to. Usually it's like that long strands of pork, but this is more like chopped up versions. And it's actually really good. I can taste that smoky flavor as well. Alex got chicken Cajun pasta. What do you think? Thumbs up? He thinks it's good. Good choices.
All right, guys, we are back at the hotel. It is just about to be 10 p.m. And we are babies. We are like, we were standing in line to go into the Lego store. And then we looked at each other. We're like, should we wait? Because there was a line to go in. So we were like, should we wait? We're tired. Let's go. But in our defense, we woke up at 2 a.m. California time. So it is 10 p.m. Florida time now so we are beaten tired and then we have to repeat 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 this whole week our Disney Springs experience was nice the food was really good highly recommend House of Blues it has really good food and good vibes good atmosphere so I recommend that afterwards we walked around and I like honestly like it's overwhelming it is so huge there like if you've been to Disneyland downtown disney like it's like four times bigger than that and it's like just like it feels like a giant mall it's like connected to a mall and it's like so big we walked so much tonight but i feel like we missed so much as we were walking back to you know the uber to pick us up i kept thinking like oh this is it but no we kept having to go and and walk more and i was like this is it no but no it wasn't like it was never ending i'm like oh my gosh like how big is this place it was really nice but it is a lot of shops and a lot of eating so i did get some stuff actually i'll show you guys on our plane right here i watched beauty and the beast because we are going to eat at the beauty and the beast castle at magic kingdom so i saw this chip cup and i was like oh, i have to get it it was 25 dollars, so this is so cute and then i wanted to get some disney world ears because like i said i want disney world so i got these these are black ones and they have a glitter bow i'm not a big of a fan of glitter but they only had two options for disney world and the other bow was like full on glitter and it was blue so i was like eh. so i just went with this one and it's nice thank you guys for watching my video i hope you guys enjoyed our travel day and our, our first night here at florida orlando i hope you guys enjoyed this video and we are going to go to all of the parks we're also going to universal as well so i'm going to be filming all of our days while we are here so check out those videos if you guys are interested thank you guys and i'll see you guys next time bye good night